get a phone call to some of the tech uh, Quebecois and they say, how would you like a retrospective? And I said, I'd love it. So uh, Montreal gives me a retrospective. And that's the first time, basically, that The Bitter Ash is screened before the public. It's public, you know, done. And then we come in and it is shown here for the first time in Vancouver in 2003 to the public. So when I asked Larry for any advice he had for current UBC film students, I'd have to say, I wasn't surprised with his answer. If you go to film school to be a commercial filmmaker or, or an edit, a commercial editor or a commercial cinematography, it seems to me that you might as well shoot yourself. I mean, it's like being an accountant. To go and do, you know, cookie cutter shit is, is, is a huge mistake. You get this great opportunity to have a vision, to, to put it down. I mean, I don't, I think that's what you, that what you should do. There is no greater high or satisfaction than actually to be able to make a film and say, this is the film I wanted to make. These are the people I wanted to work with, you know, and the pleasure of working with people you want to work with in a creative atmosphere on a vision you want to put out there, you know. So, in other words, don't make movies, become an accountant. <laughs> no, that's, that's what I feel. Yeah.